Alright y'all. <laughs> New camera. Who this? It's your boy Footy. Um, so first of all, I really want to talk about Kyle Fuller, but well, not really because I just needed an excuse to put out a video and play with my new toy. Um, and I'm gonna, you guys bear with me because things may not be perfect right away, but hopefully you guys can tell the difference in camera quality. Um, I just purchased a new camera and honestly guys, all of this is for y'all. A lot of you guys like when I do the vlogging videos in the car and I said, hey, I want to get back to that. I said, hey, I need to, you know, get my computer fixed and be able to get back in the editing mode and being able to kind of, you know, do those clean edits that y'all like. So that's kind of like where I work and I'm also working my live stream situation and it's not perfect right now. It's not super clean, but hey. You know, I'm working. So, in all that, this is for you. You. All this, everything I do, the boogers in my nose. Hopefully, it ain't no. no, no. <laughs> my bad, y'all. It's windy in Merlin. Hopefully, my nose don't look crazy. My mother always used to be on me about my nose. Make sure your nose don't look crazy, boy. Anyway, it's all for you guys, seriously. And so, in that, um,. I hope you guys enjoy it. Uh, I hope the quality looks clean because I'll never be like super edit guy. Like I'll never be like, you know, trying to like go super crazy with the edits. I know like Sky does some crazy edits. I can't even, I can't even compete. But I said, I owe it to this community. Us community is a people that, cause I don't look, you guys aren't fans of mine. You guys are, you know, you guys are, we're, we're the, 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 the Cowboys community. You guys may agree with my opinion, may, you know, differ from my opinion at times but you guys if it's one thing that you guys do do is you guys support me and that means the world um oh i want to give a shout out to the homie james i met him in a park on um i live in the dmv area and i met him in the park on what day was that was that sunday i met him in the park on sunday and he was a fan well a supporter of the show and that just means the world to me y'all really really does let's talk kyle fuller for a second kyle fuller is actually the type of free agent that i would want if you could get him on a cheap now, it sounds like he was a cap casualty, which, you know, those happen. But when you go back to 2018, he had an amazing, amazing year. You know, eight picks, Pro Bowl year. I think he was a Pro Bowl. You guys correct me on that. But I just think that he's the type guy that, you know, you bring him in, and now you're not pigeonholed. Because even though you have J. Lou, J. Lou more sly guy, even though you have Anthony Brown, now, I don't know what the numbers would be like with Fuller, what he thinks his market is. But if he's hanging around and there's no noise for him, to me, it's a no-brainer. Like, I think that's the player that Dallas needs to spend money on. Because I think with this secondary, hey, Trevon Diggs is your guy. But I think Kyle Fuller can come in and be a decent two for a few years. And now you're not forced to reach on corner because you still have so many needs elsewhere. And we know the needs, and, and I'll continue. Hey, I got the new camera. I got the ability to live stream now, do all sorts of stuff. So I'm just of the mindset is like, look, I think that he is a – he's not a name guy. I just – I don't think – I think he I think he's a player. When I watch Kyle Fuller play, I just see a good football player. I do. Um, and I think that, hey, for all intents and purposes, he can help this team. So – I kind of want to get your guys' opinion on it because I think he's the one free agent. I stay away from free agents. I really, really do. But if there's one free agent who I say, hmm, that player helps this team, hmm, I would kick the tires on that player. It's Kyle Fuller. You guys, he has, a, he has listen, he has NFL tutelage in his, in his background, family, all was in the league, all were DBs and athletes. Um, what do you guys think about what I'm saying right there? Because to me, you bring Kyle Fuller in, now corner doesn't even have to be looked at till the third round, and now the Rashawn Slater plan for Foots is in full effect. Hey, oh. He's back. It's your boy Foots. Hey.